Hello? 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 Yes, Mr. Muslim Prince, how are you? You have what? About I have two three doubts about Christianity. Can you explain me? You have a three doubt. Why why not one hundred? Are you uh, are you the same I as uh, are, you, I, are you are you are you are you are you are you a Trinity Muslim? Because your prophet when he says Salam alaikum he say it three time. When he do do he do it three time. When he do anything, he say when he say when he say this guy won the debate, he say it three times. So now you have a three doubt about Christianity. I mean, why three? Why not four? <laughs> um, Francis, Fra uh, sorry, not Francis. Sorry, Christian Prince. Listen, hmm. uh, I, I want to have one doubt, please. Uh, two two doubts, hmm. mainly two doubts. The hmm. one is New Testament. So what happened now? It, is, it, it, uh, it was a three. Why you make it two? Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, yes, third doubt is also there, but, but no. yeah, these are the main two doubts. Please, 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 please. Mm. Yeah, listen to me. So, but but you, you don't want to talk uh, about our topic? You don't want to talk about our topic? Because our topic is very interesting too. We can talk about your topic, no problem. But I have in front of me a verse from the yeah. Quran saying that Allah will cause you to forget the Quran. And I don't understand really because as like you are a Muslim prince, obviously you're high authority, like you know what you're talking about. So why Allah will send me the Quran and then he will cause me to forget the Quran? Please. We are discussing your topic, my friend. Here we go. Allah, he sent the Bible, and now he forgot the whole Bible. This is what we are talking about. Where is the Bible? It's gone. Do you have the Bible? You don't have the Bible. I mean, what kind of God, what, what, kind, what kind of God your God is? You Muslim, you claim there's no Bible no more. Okay, isn't it the Bible sent by Allah? Okay, so Allah sent the Bible, and then he caused us to forget the Bible. I'm asking you, where on the topic? <laughs> you know, what kind of God? He sent the Bible, and he make it forget the Bible. Why he did that? Uh, CP. What CP? I want an answer, my friend. Here we go. You call me and you were you were excited to, you were excited to expose me. And here we go. We have we are talking about the Bible. Forget about the Quran, brother. Allah he sent the Torah, brother. A brother, a brother. Allah he sent the Torah. Allah he sent the Torah. Okay, Allah and then Allah caused us to forget the Torah. Why? Explain to me. I'm listening to you. <laughs> What a stupid religion. What's wrong with you? Why why you are scared to answer? I mean you are the Muslim. I'm asking you. I don't 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 answer me. Just explain yourself as a Muslim how you can believe in such a madness. So Allah is in the book, and then Allah will make you forget the book. And then Allah will accuse you of corrupting the book, which he caused you to forget it. I mean explain to me. I can I'm really going crazy here, brother. I didn't understand your doubt. Okay, let me explain it to you more. Who is the one who sent the Torah? <clears throat> Allah. Okay. Where is the Torah? Uh, like, what do you mean? Well, oh, okay. See, uh, it, it, it did exist in an uncorrupted form. No, no, where, 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 where is that? No, no, my friend, don't, don't tell me it exists. Where it exists? Do you have it? No. Okay. So, Allah, did Allah cause a, did Allah cause you Muslim to forget the Torah? Forget it. So where uh, it is? It was it was distorted. If 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 if. So Allah, He okay. Isn't it the Quran says nothing but happened by the will of Allah? Uh, yes, yes, yes. Okay. So that, like but that's Allah mean okay. Is, so the, so. Uh, Islam the, also teaches us that Allah is all just. Since okay. Allah is all just. Hmm. Like divine will and human will isn't like sync. Like I mean, uh, you have you have both wills in sync. Like. Allah doesn't force things to do, but everything that exists is, is like it is within the subset of God's will. Hmm. Well, this is not what the Quran is saying. This is your own fiction. You know, look like you are watching too much cartoon because the Quran says that Allah. Oh, here we go. The Quran. You see, our judge is the Quran, not your cartoon. You know, you are watching Mickey Mouse. This is the Quran saying that Allah He entrusted the Jews to protect the Torah. So what Allah he did, read the Quran, chapter 5, verse number 44. CCP, CCP, CCP. Hmm. CCP, do you, you, you want to discuss Kamil Yudin? You no, know, this, is, this is more, my friend, trust me, this Quran smells more than Kamil Yudin. This is stink. Don't change the topic. 
what kind of God he sent the Torah and then he says I trust you to protect the Torah which means he want to protect the Torah and then the Torah is gone wait, 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 wait. Where, where does it say where does it say God trusted to protect the Torah chapter 5 verse number 44 chap wait let me open chapter 5 verse number 44 hmm. verse number 44 hmm. Uh, okay, uh, it doesn't say Allah will protect it. It says there, for it, it for for to them, it was entrusted the protection of Allah book. No, no, no. To, in my translation, it says, indeed, we send down the Torah in which we was was mm. guidance and light. Mm. The prophets who submitted to God judged by it for the Jews. Mm. And? For the Jews. As did the rabbis and scholars by that which they were interested of the scripture of Allah. Thank, thank you. You just, said, you, you just said exactly what I said. They are entrusted to the book of Allah. <laughs> so Allah, he trusts the rabbi <laughs> to, to protect his book. Does it say that? You just read that. It doesn't say protect his book. It says there was entrusted entrusted in, yes intru was no it says no 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 hold on hold on which means in what they order to keep to protect so when I do that it means I protect it I keep it I will never let it go destroy so Allah he is the one who is saying he entrusted the Jews what Jews the rabbi specifically and the prophets to do what to protect the Torah this is what the verse is saying you can open any interpretation you want Give me 20 seconds. No problem. Uh, I will give you 20 years. When will you clarify my doubt? Huh? I have one doubt. I have some doubts. Uh, when, when, when do you think you can clarify them? What, what? I have some doubts about Christianity. Some my friend, you are a Muslim. What doubt about Christianity? I am, my, see, my, see, name, my name is that can make doubt. You are a Muslim. So you don't say I have some doubt about Christianity. Either you believe in Christianity or you are a Muslim. Are you a Muslim or a Christian? Regarding are you a Muslim or a, are you a Muslim or a Christian? I'm a Muslim. Okay, so what you are saying? I have a doubt about Christianity. This is this is a very very uh, an untruthful statement because we this is something. No, no. This is a statement. Somebody will say if he is a Christian, I have a doubt about my faith. But you don't say to somebody else you don't believe in anyway. About I have doubt about it. This is this is silly from you to say. Speak as an adult, please. So don't share the topic now. What kind of God? He sent the Torah to the Jews and he entrusted the Jews to protect the Torah. And then Allah, he confirmed that nobody can destroy his word and nobody can exchange his word. And then Allah is saying in the Quran in different verse that Allah will cause even Muslims to forget the Quran and to forget the Torah and to forget his words. Does it say that or I'm lying? Uh, just just give, give me one minute. Uh... Hmm. Surah 544, did you just check, let me check something. Mm, check something. Uh, yeah. Okay. And <clears throat> give me 20 seconds. 544, 544. We'll give you 20 years, no problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> as long as we have a camera urine, I mean, who cares? We have all the time. Camera urine is the best. Forget about the rest. In, in your Instagram bio, it says that you're a scholar, okay? Yeah, I'm a, I'm a scholar in your email. I like, no, I'm, 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 I'm schooling you every day. Have you ever seen a Muslim calling me? He didn't get busted. No, 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 no. no. But, uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. CP, again, again. <laughs> CP, can you name me? I'll ask you a quick question. You, you no, I cannot name you. I can, I cannot name you. I cannot name you because the only scholar I know, the only teacher, I, the only, the only teacher, the only teacher I have, the only teacher I have is Zach and Nick. Anything you want about Zach and Nick, I, I will answer you. Anything else, I don't know. Now, don't change the topic. You are being a kid now. You are trying to escape the stupidity of your God. What kind of God? He sent the book and he caused you to forget the book. Look at 
Okay, so. So what happened? Allah, he entrusted the Jews to protect the book. Was Allah wrong in his trust? Did he trust the wrong one? When I say to you, I trust you, what does that mean? Explain to me. What the word trust mean in your language, in your understanding, in your knowledge? Uh, in the case of people, uh, I'm sorry. Hmm. See, you're not ask, answering a single question that I've asked. You did not ask me any question, and you are changing the topic, and you are playing a kid like a kid. You, okay, you know, I, you I, know I, in I, the mo I, in I, the I, morning, I, in the when you text me in the morning, it, you were so excited. Okay. I'm going to expose you. I'm going to get you busted. I'm and now here we go. You are calling me. Suddenly you became a potato. My friend, my friend, why you don't want to say to us what kind of God are you ashamed? This God, he sent the book, he trusts the listen, Jews. Listen, listen, what did he did, did, word he, word, did, word, did, word, did word, he did he did he do did he Musa ibn Amra? Mm. Listen, mm. hello. Uh. Yeah, where we reveal to the, the, the Torah, the ISS, mm. uh, like it means we reveal the Torah to Musa alayhi salam. Mus Musa, Musa who? You said you said you said Musa, hold on. Hold on, you, you said, you said, Musa, you said, you said, you said, no, 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 you said something, I heard the word, uh, I, I heard the word, I want to be sure you said that, you said Musa ibn Imran, correct? Yeah. Okay, so Musa, guys, is ibn Imran, are you sure? Yes. Okay, the chapter of al Imran, chapter in the Quran, it's called chapter of al Imran, is that correct? I'm not changing the topic. I'm not changing the topic. I'm not. I'm not changing the topic. I'm not changing the topic. I am not. Trust me, I am not. How in the world that Mary, her father, his name is Umran, and Musa's, his father is Umran, and the brother of Musa's, he is the brother of Mary. So here we go. Musa's is the son of Umran. Harun is the son of Umran. Maryam, Maryam is the son of Amran. So according to your stupid Quran, Moses is the uncle of Jesus. This is why I say to you, you are the one who said, guys, did, did he say, did he say, did, 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 he, did he say, did he say, Muhammad, Muhammad Hijab, we got him busted, he's a stupid, he's a coward, you don't even dare to debate me. You start playing videos and hang up on me. He's a coward. Sorry, sorry. Listen to me, listen to me, listen to me. You will not... What kind okay. of a prophet, what kind of a prophet he say that Musa ibn Umran okay. and Mary ibn, ibn to Umran, how Musa and Umran, they became, they became, they became, they became. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Please. Okay. Okay. It says, verily we reveal the Torah, it means like we reveal, like God revealed Torah to mm. Musa alayhi salam, mm. then the next, uh, what is, in which was guidance in the past of in the past tense, mm -hmm. it means like as it guided people to faith and truth and protected against and protected people against mm -hmm. falsehood and misguidance. Mm -hmm. And then it says and light, guidance and light. Mm -hmm. It means like what, the, the word and what, light what verse you are reading? What, ver what, what verse you are reading? Illuminate the dark. What, what verse you are reading? Confusion. What verse you are reading? Uh, Surah 544. Surah 5, verse what? 44. 44. Okay, go ahead. Read it for us. Can you read it for us? All right. Yeah, verily we reveal the Torah in which was guidance and light. Uh, hmm. And then it says, uh, like, the prophets who submitted a judge by it for the Jews. Hmm. I'll, I'll explain it word by word, yeah. Now it says, and light, and guidance and light. It means, like, Torah had, <coughs> Torah uh, originally that was revealed to Musa had hmm. light to illuminate the darkness of confusion. Hmm. Species arguments with the desires, etc., etc. Hmm. And now it says, uh, like it says, uh, the prophets who submitted judged by it for the Jews. Yes, hmm. it was like a law for the Jews, of hmm. course. Hmm. Uh, like in, in cases of dispute, questions, and in the fiqhi rulings, in this case, uh, like. Uh, Basically, the, the prophets followed the teaching of the Torah, and then, uh, like, as did the rabbis and the scholars. That is, the religious leaders of the Jews hmm. ruled on the basis of the Torah. The word translated here as rabbis, like, I mean, refers to knowledgeable people hmm. who act upon their knowledge and teach others in the best way, 
and mm. they follow the path of the compassionate prophets in their dealings with the people. Mm. Well, the well, word translated here as but, scholars refers but, to but where, where is, scholars. I mean, you are, you are, you are talking too much. You are saying nothing, my friend. I want the answer. Did Allah trusted the Rabbi in the protection of the Torah? Yes or no? Uh, did did Allah entrust the no no not not in a sense that Torah will be preserved after handing it over to the rabbis in that sense? No. Okay, guys, okay, not in the sense that the Rabbi will preserve it. So who is the one who should preserve it? You are the one who said that. Remember, not me, guys. Not in the sense. Was, Hold on, you are the, you are the one who said. No, so listen, 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 listen. Let me finish. You are the one who just said. It is not the rabbi who they are interested to protect the Torah. So who is the one supposed to protect it? Ah uh, no 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 no! I didn't say they are not interested to protect the Torah. I said that the ayah doesn't mean that the rabbis are going to necessarily protect it in the future. That's what I said. Okay, so what does it mean when you say entrusted? That's mean he he trusted them, correct? Okay, if it means that the religious leaders of the Jews, mm -hmm. uh, what? like the knowledgeable people, uh -huh. they. Uh, they acted according to the Torah. They they uh, they Fo follow the path. Focus the path on the, the trust Torah thing, my friend. It. Stop playing games. Focus on the trust. Allah did He trust the Jews to protect the Torah? Did He or did not? No. Okay. Who is the one in charge no. of protecting the Torah then? Okay. It doesn't say. And in my translation, it doesn't say. Uh, don't tell me. I, I, I don't care. I'm asking you who is the one supposedly will will protect the Torah. If not, the Jews are supposed to protect it according to your understanding. I'm going with you. No problem. Who is the one should no, protect okay, the book of Allah? My, according to my understanding, hmm. uh, Torah was support, supposed to be corrupted. It, it, it was going to happen. Hmm. It so why, why is supposed? Is that, is, that, is, is that Allah's decision? He wanted to be corrupted? What do you mean supposed to be corrupted? Oh, okay, okay. I'll tell you mm. what. What I mean by it was supposed to be corrected is that it is, it is, uh, it is the father of Allah. Uh -huh. That doesn't mean Allah forced it to happen, but, okay. but it means that it was within Allah's will. All right, guys. Allah, He made the fate for the Quran, the fate, the destiny, correct? The destiny of the Torah to be corrupted, correct? The what? The destiny, destiny. You just said qadar. Qadar means the destiny. Okay, okay. okay. Yeah, so yeah, guys, yeah, 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 yeah. Mr. Muslim Prince, he said that it was Allah's decision, his decision, that the destiny of the Torah to be corrupted. That's mean Allah is the shaitan. Because if is the, the who is the one who who is the one who corrupt? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Who is the one who will get the benefit? Hold on. Who is the one who will get the benefit from corrupting the book of Allah? You tell me. Give me an answer. Benefit from uh, corrupting the book of Allah. Mm, who? Firstly, firstly, before I answer this, I I don't, no, don't tell me first and secondly. No, no, no. It's, the answer is simple. Who is the one? Let us say that they assume that Allah is God. We assume for the sake of argument. Who is the one will get the benefit of corrupting the book of God? Who is the one get the benefit? I will name for you three people. Uh, I will name for you three people. people uh, hold on. I will, I will name for you three people: Muhammad, Jibril, or Shaitan. Which one you choose? None. None. So Shaitan will not get the benefit of corrupting the book of Allah. Shaitan will just mislead people. I will not. Okay, but isn't it? <laughs> isn't it? Is it okay, but is it? But isn't it corrupting the book of Allah is the biggest misleading ever? I mean, this is how smart you are. You just say Shaitan, he want to mislead you, but corrupting a book is going to mislead people. Don't you agree? Hey, hey, Francis, CCP, CCP. <laughs> he keep calling me Francis. Okay, Somebody told him my name is a Francis. Right? <laughs> listen, and listen, listen. No, no, no. Who is the one will get? This is the book of no, Allah. No, this, is not, this is not. This is Jesus not. We are. Hinduism. We are not. No, 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 no. You see, no. That, that, that's no. That, 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 no. That's that's stupid. Of, that is a stupid of you. That is a stupid of you to say because God created the people. He did not make them Hindu. We don't believe in this in Christianity. We don't believe in faith like you. But you are the one who just said to me, "This is your belief, not our belief." It's you, according to you. Allah He made the Hindu Hindus. Allah He made the Christian Christians. Allah He made the Jews Jews. This no, is. Made doesn't mean like He forced them. He no, He forced them. Like okay, let me. Okay, are you saying? Okay, Muslim Prince, are you saying? Are you saying your your prophet is a liar? <clears throat> no, 
Okay. What what kind of work will make a man when Adam he commit a sin? Did he commit a sin because of his choice or because Allah forced him? It was because of Allah's choice and Adam's choice in sync. What do you mean? It was both both their wills. Both, both it was Adam's free will and God's free will. Like sorry, not God's free will, but God's well, will as well. Obviously, both. obviously, okay, both. okay, thank you. Obviously, that's mean your prophet is a liar. Because here we go, your prophet in Sahih al Bukhari. Hold on, in Sahih al Bukhari, and put it in the screen, he can watch it. It says that Musa, as he accused Adam, that because of you, we are out of heaven. Okay, Musa is accusing Adam. So Adam, he said to him, Are you blaming me for an action which I must commit? For Allah, he read it for me in my faith 40 years before my creation. I have to commit, it's a must to commit. So you said to me, you did lie to us saying that this is the free will of Adam and the decision of Allah. That's a big fat lie. And your prophet, he exposed you. So either you are lying to me or Muhammad is lying to me. Which one is a liar between you? Uh, your misinterpretation of my hadith is My liar. friend, no, so my, my friend, don't say, don't, don't say, Mr. don't tell me misinterpretation. The hate in front of us, you are more than welcome to read it and take your time to explain it. What do you say? Are you are you willing to explain it to us and then everybody will see that you are fabricating answers have nothing to do with what happened are you willing to read it uh, or you are not willing to read it <clears throat> cp listen we i think we have spent enough time discussing your doubt I no 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 we are not uh, we, we did not get the answer time. yet no, my friend we have to get the answer please, we get no please, answer please, yet please, please, don't force me now. to hang up on you you promised me you would expose me either you get me busted right now or you have nothing to say you just say you just say it a big fat lie you just expose you just insulted your prophet that he's a big fat liar because your prophet saying that adam must commit sin it's a fate uh, everybody here has heard us that i have explicitly said that it was your misinterpretation that okay then you have okay no problem guys me. it is my misinterpretation so why you want to read what your prophet said and then we will see if it's my misinterpretation see, see, see. okay i'll answer you listen uh, according to islam we have free will that is explicit and according to islam there are texts like not even a leaf falls except by Allah's permission. So to reconcile both texts, hmm. what we say. Is okay, that can you show me? Can you can you show me? Can you show me one statement of your prophet about a free will? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Just hmm. give me ten seconds here. Yeah? Okay. Sure. Hmm. Uh, I'll show you either from the Quran or the Sunnah. I can't say that my prophet will say, but yes, hmm. inshallah, from Quran or Sunnah. Okay, also. so why? Okay, I have it in front of you. In the front of you, my friend. It says it clearly that Adam he commits sin for it was a decree from Allah. Are you accusing your prophet to be a liar? Does it say it's a decree from Allah? Does it say that he must commit? Does it say he have no choice but to do? Does it say that you are you blaming me? Are you blaming me for what is written for me before I was created? For a sin I have to commit. It's in the front of you, man. Stop being a stubborn. Can't you can't you be can't you be honest? Can't you be honest? Can't you be honest? The debate is what? Do you blame me or you don't blame me? You're a prophet, he took the side of Adam that we cannot blame Adam for the sin he commit. It's very clear, even your prophet said, so uh, so uh, Adam confuted Adam. Do you have any plans of do you have any plans of debating for it? He's the coward, he don't dare to call me. Give me his Skype, I will call him right now. He's a potato. He, he, he said that he will book your flight ticket. But you see, not, you see, you, you, this is this is additional proof that he's a coward because everybody knows I will not go anywhere. I do not need to go anywhere. It take a call in Skype and everybody either will laugh at him or at me. This is an excuse because he knew that I don't go anywhere. So it's like saying to Allah, I challenge you, Allah, come to me. But everybody knows Allah will not come. So it's it's a challenge. It's a challenge. Of a, it's a challenge of a coward. Your 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 Fifi your Fifi. He knew I'm not going to do that. I don't do that to anyone. Like, did you see me ever going to debate anyone in the stage before? Is it like something about Farid only because he's something like a superstar? He's a stupid idiot kid. So he is a coward. 
Hijab himself accept to accept my call in Skype. He did not let me talk. He hung up on me eight times. I did not even talk 30 seconds. They are a bunch of cowards. So they make excuses. How come they are willing to take a Skype call from everybody? Did this guy debate the apostate prophet in Skype? Yes, he did. How come he can't do it with me? Because he's a potato. He is he is terrified. Like you, you are doing poop on your panty now. And look, here we go. The hate in front of you. You change to Fifi. What Fifi can let her Fifi help you? <laughs> yeah. the, this Fifi, he he speak in Skype always. All what he do is in YouTube. Suddenly he wanna fly to me. He wanna have a date with me. If he wanna see Christian Prince, I cannot. I cannot do it unless I see Christian Prince. I wanna see Christian Prince. Please, I, I challenge you. I challenge you. I mean, isn't it obvious that this is a challenge of a belly dancer? Christian Prince, how old are you? How old are you? I am in the age of your grand grandfather. What does this have to do with this, my idiot? Answer: Is that your prophet saying? That this is the destiny of Adam and nobody can blame him. Nobody can blame him. Allah he wrote in the destiny of Adam 40 years before he created me, created him that this is a sin he must commit, yes or no? <clears throat> no. Well, sorry the hate for us then. Uh, see, 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 don't force me hang up on you. Read it. It says, Do you blame me? for doing a deed which Allah had decreed that I should do 40 years before he created me. Then your prophet says, so Adam got the better of Musa's argument. And he repeat that three times like you. So Muhammad, he agreed with Adam that we cannot blame Adam for the sin he commit, for this is the decree from Allah 40 years before he created him. Uh, <coughs> Christian Prince, um, <laughs> regarding like, like, see, we, we definitely believe that there is God's will and free will, of course, but uh, don't tell me we believe. You see, you are changing the topic. Your prophet, either you, I want you to comment com what your prophet said. Your prophet, he agree that we cannot blame Adam for his sin. He said, he said it clearly. He didn't that makes it clean to you. Uh, he said it clearly. It's simple. Musa said to him, because of you, we are of paradise. Adam, he said to him, no, you cannot blame me for something which Allah decreed for me 40 years before he created me. Your prophet took the side of Adam. So we, it's, it's very simple. Can we blame Adam for his sin? No. Why? Because it was a decree of Allah. The hate is very simple. Which hadith is this? Adam and Musa alayhi This all over. What do you want? I can give you tons of them. Which one you want? <clears throat> this is the, as an example here, Sahih Muslim, so you can't say it's weak. Sahih Muslim, hadith number 2652. Hadith number 18. Allah tells us that man, okay, I'll give you by evidence right now that we have free will. Allah tells us that man believes and does righteous deeds, like from like from free will, hmm. uh, then he enters Jannah, hmm. or, and when he disbelieves, he will enter Jahannam. Hmm. Okay? What? And uh, what? 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 Say again? Oh yeah, yeah. Allah, firstly, Allah says that Allah is just. Uh, like if Allah. What this had to do with my question, man? Uh, guys, Allah is just. No, Allah is not just. Let me show you. When you commit adultery, do Allah punish you for adultery? Yes or no? Uh, Allah can forgive. No, no, I'm not asking you. Okay, let us say somebody. Uh, he commit adultery and he asks for repentance according to Islam still he will be punished so let us say he repent he forgive but what if somebody he did not repent Allah will punish him if he, even if he does not repent Allah can forgive so Allah will not punish anyone for adultery are you saying that to me no, no, I'm saying that except major shirk Mm -hmm. Allah, it's up to Allah if Allah will forgive or not forgive. Okay, we will go to Allah the shark. Okay, we forgive. will go to the shark. But if somebody commit adultery, and then he will go to hell for one of the sins he commit is adultery, Allah will punish him or not? Not necessarily. Maybe yes, maybe no. It depends to Allah. Allah will decide it on Qiyamah. Okay, no problem. So it's maybe yes, right? Yeah, it's maybe yes. Okay, yeah. is adultery is a choice you make or it is a decree from Allah? It is both. It is both. <laughs> 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 
No, you are a liar. Read the hadith. Here we go. It's in front of you. This is the hadith in the screen. Read it for us. Just give me one minute. Yeah. Hmm. In uh, in Surah. Read the Hadith. I have it for you in the screen. Don't tell me Surah Bura. Surah Bura. Listen. The Hadith in front of you. Let me read it for you. The Prophet said, not me. Verily, Allah has fixed the very portion of adultery, which the man. Fine, fine, fine. Yeah, yeah. Listen, listen. Okay. Regarding free will. Listen, listen now. Surah 9. No, read the hadith. Read the hadith. Read the hadith. You can read the surah for me after. No problem. Read the hadith. We, we don't change the topic. We are talking about adultery now. You you said you said that both of them. That's is very very funny. Because that's mean you call Allah. Say Allah. Hey, I'm going to do adultery. Do you like me to do it? Allah. He says yes. So Allah is a partner in the in the bed with you. <laughs> it's in front of you. It's on the screen. Hey, Sahih Muslim two six five seven B. Two six five seven B. Yeah, and later we'll talk about coronavirus. Or I mean coronavirus. Which is the same. Two six five seven B. Okay. Hmm. Read it. Two six five seven B. Two six five seven B. Yeah. Sahih Muslim. Yeah, two six five six two six five seven B. Verily, Allah has fixed the very portion of adultery which a man will indulge in, and which mm. he of necessity must commit. The mm. adultery of the eyes, the lustful look, and mm. the adultery. Of... Yeah, yeah. Okay. So okay. yeah, yeah. So, so yeah. it's a what? So, uh, it's a necessity. He must commit. It's not a choice. Why you are lying to me? Says the free will. It's a necessity. He must commit. So why Allah will punish you? How how stupid this religion is? So is corrupting the Torah is a necessity he must commit you are the one who said to me it's a qadr from allah it's a destiny from allah to corrupt, corrupt the torah and this is in total agreement with this so it's allah so allah is the she biggest is fat lying. liar allah, allah is the biggest fraud okay hold on how you go sleep with the women and then it is allah who decide for you before he created you that you will sleep with that woman and it's a sin which against allah and then Allah will punish you for the sin which is against Allah. But He is the one who forces you to do it. Types of texts which are which are in contrast. Take care, my friend. Take care. I have no time. No, no time for kids. I have no time for kids. I'm not going to waste my time. It's it's, it's in front of you. Stop playing games. I'm shame on you. It says he must commit. What a bunch of kids. A necessity. Not he only will commit. It's a necessity to commit. Do you see it? Which of necessity must commit? I cannot find one mature Muslim I can speak to. They are a bunch of kids, all of them. It's impossible. It's like it's a mission impossible. Why are you are calling me back? Why are you are calling me uh, back? CB, Will you avoid it? You, you see, listen. I don't. I don't. I'm not going to debate people who they are proven to be liars. You are lying. The hate in front of you. It says it's a necessity. You must commit. Either you are saying this is what it says. Be honest, or leave. Okay, okay, CP, I agree. It says it's a necessity. Okay, okay right. so how Allah will punish you? Okay, that's and wonderful. Surah, and Surah 9, Ayah 70 are in a contrast. <laughs> so whenever there are two texts which are in contrast, mm. you, what you do is you, you you try to reconcile them and form one doctrine. So so you have one Ayah that explicitly says, Surah 9, Ayah 70 explicitly says about free will. And the Hadith Surah, you Surah, said, Surah, what, what, what Surah? Surah, 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 hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Surah 970, you said? 70? Yes, Surah 970. Nine, okay. So, chapter 9, verse number 70, correct? Yeah. Okay. Read it for us. Has not the story reached them of those before them, the hmm. people of Nuh? 
Ad and Tamud, the people of Ibrahim, the dwellers of Madian, mm. and the cities overthrown, <coughs> to them came their messengers with clear proofs. Mm. So it was not Allah who wronged them, but they used to wrong themselves. Okay, so you agree with this verse? Do you agree with this verse? Yes. Okay. You see, this is a proof that the Quran is a false book. Because according to your God, your fate is written for you about your bad deed and good deed when he created you. So those people, they did yeah. what Allah, he made them do. He, this is not, they are wronging themselves. And here you see the stupidity of the, 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 the author of the Quran. Because Allah, he said okay, okay. that there is no sin you will do. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on. Okay. I gave you. I, let's, say, uh, okay, hold let's on. say there is a swimming pool, okay? What? If, let's say there is a swimming pool and uh, and a person is about to jump. He's he's standing on the dive board, okay? Hmm. And he's about to jump. And I go like that person's name is CP, and I am behind him, hmm. and he's about to jump, and I push him, hmm. and my push and his jump is exactly at the same time. So, will you say that he jumped by himself, or would you say that I pushed him? Well, Which this, one is it? But you see, right? but, but you see, you have no place in the Quran. It says that both happen at the same time. You are fabricating your own story. Yeah, because okay, okay, okay. Let me let, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Hold on. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold uh, on. Who is the one who make people kuffar? <sighs> they themselves. Themselves. Okay, guys. Both. Okay. Okay, guys, themselves, they are the one who made them kuffar. Let us see if this is true or not. I want you to read for me the Quran. Oh, guys, chapter, hold on, no, no, no. Chapter 6, verse number 107. Chapter number 6. Verse 107. 107. Uh, verse 107. But if Allah had willed, they would not have associated. Uh, <laughs> and we have not appointed you over them as a guardian. Are you? Um, uh, hmm. No, are you? So a it is. The, it is. Yes, it, this talks about like that. You cannot make anybody believe or disbelieve. Okay, hold you on. You just have to like it, the basic message of this ayah. No. Is that in no. okay. you just have to go no, 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 have taken be, be this is not only about being sin this is the biggest sin it is Allah will that you they, those people they will they will worship beside him okay let me show you how ignorant you are in your religion is it in the Quran in the chapter of the at, at the queer it says uh, you cannot will something if Allah don't will it which means it's the will of Allah it's not your will there we go in the chapter of the queer let, us, let me open it. Let me, let me uh, open it. Listen. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, my friend. Just take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Yeah, as easy. Okay. <clears throat> let me pop open the the verse for you and give me a second. CP, are you an Islamic scholar? I am the master of Allah, not only scholar. Your Allah Himself can. Your 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 Allah Himself, He cannot debate me, my friend. That's the truth. Just can you just, can you just name it. me one Don't. ulama, one scholar mm. who can you name me one scholar who said that camel urine is haram? Name me one scholar. Mm, one scholar is camel urine or haram. There's many of them. Anyone who don't agree with the hadith of 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 of, of uh, 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 any hadith, he will say this is not allowed. Not allowed. There's tons of them. There are thousand of them. Because you Muslim, you keep agreeing, disagree about anything. Even the one which agree about the Muslims at the end of the fatwa, they say the the the, the scholars they agree about not to agree about this topic. And you are telling me which is scholar? Uh, yeah, yeah. So so basically, <laughs> uh, the Quran is and Imam is najis and it is impure. My friend, my friend, 
it, it, it doesn't matter why you are changing the topic is it Allah will I'm, that people actually I came here to you know you know is it is it you know in the Quran the Quran is so clear it says it clearly that Allah he is the one who 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 made the will happen and what is the will that anything you do it is a destiny for you and this is one of the basic belief in Islam if you don't believe in the qadr of Allah you aren't a Muslim let me make it simple for you if a baby is born I, I, he's a Muslim hold on hold on yeah, hold on hold on hold on just make it simple, simple. Just, 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 you know, just, just the final hit in your nose if a baby is born and he is just a kid he is like five yet five days old if he die where he will go uh, if he if he's what five days what? Yeah, he's a he's a child of a Muslim family and he died. He's five years, five days old or one month old. Where he will go? Okay. He will go to hell or to heaven? Uh, on Qiyamah, there will be uh, Allah will ask the mentally insane people like in this life whoever was who died as children <laughs> who were mentally insane those children those those people Allah will ask him Allah will ask him and the judge Allah will ask the infant in the judgment day ask him for what the guy he did not do anything no 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 no, no. Allah, Allah will not ask him uh, he like this he will not be just for his salvation in this life he will have a separate test Mm. On Qiyamah, like they will be asked to jump. So what? What? What is the? What, what is the? What is the test? What is the test? Look, the look, okay, 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 okay. Hold on. So guys, you Muslim, that's mean. You are you are believing that after the day of judgment, there is a life, you live, and then after that life, Allah will judge you by that life, not by the life previously before you die. That is stupid. That that is not Islamic. That is not Islamic because Allah judge you. My friend, my, 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 my friend, my, okay, my friend, can you show me one verse in the Quran saying that after you die, there is an option for you to repent? Uh, no, no, it's the option to, uh, like, the, the, there will be a second test only for uh, people who died as babies and people who, uh, like, were mentally insane in this Okay, life. Wh where do you get this from? <clears throat> It's in a hadith. It's in a sahih hadith. Okay. You can see there is a video. Of okay, here we go. The, okay, the hadith in front of you. No, hold on. No, 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 no. The, vid the hadith is in front of you. It doesn't say that. Aisha, she went to attend a funeral of the child from Al Ansar, and they are Muslims, who they used to do practice the the, the ritual of the pagans like Muhammad, and they they like to do a Safa al Marwa, and this is why Muhammad he added Safa al Marwa to Islam because of the Ansar. So here we not we notice. That Muhammad attended the funeral and Aisha, she said, Well, this child will be in heaven. Muhammad he said, No, it might be the otherwise. Where is the test? It says clearly why he said, Because Allah, you see, just to show you how they lie to you. I don't know what you are getting your information from where, but they are lying to you, my friend. This is Sahih Muslim. Your prophet saying, Because Allah, He created people of hell. And those who will go to hell while they were in the backbone of their father. It is not test. Already he made decision for them where they will go. They are babies. So Aisha, she said she will go to heaven. Muhammad, he says, no, don't be stupid. Per adventure, Aisha. Don't be silly. For Allah, he created people of paradise who will go to paradise while they were in the backbone of their father because it's the Quran teach that you are the sperm is coming from the backbone which is stupid too or Allah created them or those who will go to hell Allah created their, their they will go to hell while they were in the line of their fa fa father so there's no test he is he is in the test he's in the backbone of his father not testicles and yet it, it's already the decision made where he will go have nothing to do with the sin will do this is destiny, my friend. This is what Islam believe in. This is your garbage. So stop fabricating answers. Yeah. Okay. So now, if I am a person who is going to go to hell because Allah, let us say I'm born two days old and then I die and my parents are Muslims. And then I will go to hell because Allah destiny for me. I will go to hell. Why? I will go to hell. Give me a reason. Because Allah destined it for you and you, you because of your free will both. What a free will! He's a, he's, a, he's, a, he's one day old. What free will? <laughs> Muslim prince, don't come again, please. Just just have, have mercy. Has have mercy on me, man. I, I don't have time for stupid people. Sorry. I don't mean to be rude with you, but you are being stupid. Just have mercy on me.